Victoria outlawing high country cattle grazing have backfired on the Howard government. It's been revealed Commonwealth officials first recommended the ban. Marching orders in Parliament for Liberal MPs as the Brax government came under fire over its controversial advertising campaign selling the cattle grazing ban. Well, the wonderful wildflowers. Can someone shut the cow up? This is what I think about the sneaky way they went about this advertising campaign, carefully arranged, months before they made the official announcement. And this is what I think of Steve Brax's promises. Environment Minister John Thwaites defending the dark bovine images in the ads. This photo was taken in the National Park. It is reasonable for people to see that cattle are not appropriate in a National Park. In question time, the Premier turned his sights on the Howard government over its threat to block the ban by heritage listing the mountain cattleman tradition. The Federal Environment Department's own submission recommending grazing be outlawed. We're saying effectively that in the, in the highest level of protection in our Alpine National Parks there'll be no grazing. That is consistent with New South Wales, it's consistent with the ACT, it's consistent with the Federal Government's wishes in this area. With the opposition coming in so strongly behind the mountain and cattlemen, a clear divide has been formed between the major parties as they jostle for green preferences in the lead up to the next election. But while it may have won over environment groups, the government is bracing for a rural backlash. Gareth Borum, 10 News.